Hello everyone and welcome to this live tutorial on how to install iOS 6 on any supported device. That includes... So, here we go. Before following the tutorial, you must have a jailbroken device. Unfortunately, I can't show you how to jailbreak everything, but this is a website that I recommend. It's gonna be link 1 in the description. Open your package manager of choice and add this address. Next, set your cool water and install that package. If you have an untethered jailbreak, you can install the untetherer later, but it is not my case. It's gonna do some cool stuff, and when it finishes, you will see a cool water app in the home screen. Open it and click install. Choose your iOS version and tap on storage. This is storage that will be allocated to secondary iOS partition that we're creating, and it will remove this mini storage from your existing partition. Keep in mind, this cannot be modified after the fact, unless you uninstall the secondary iOS from the cool water app or you do a restore from iTunes. This does mean you will definitely lose everything in your secondary iOS if you ever decide to have more storage. I'm going to choose the maximum for my device, 7GB. Next up, tap on I am ready. It will ask if you want a custom logo, I'm too lazy to do that, so I'm gonna choose no, and it's gonna ask if you want Vervous Boot. Vervous Boot just means I will have cool I will test when you boot into a secondary OS. And now you wait. When it finishes, it's gonna ask you to reboot. Now this is the most annoying part of this whole thing that in order to boot into a secondary OS, you're gonna need to jailbreak to access a cool booter app. In the case of this iPhone 4S, it means that it's a slow process. And also you have to resend the Phoenix app every week for this app and jailbreak it is. When you're done, tap boot and it will ask you to press the lock button. Eventually, you'll be greeted with the cool booter icon and then if you enable Rebus boot, that cool icon test. Then it's gonna reboot, do the whole jailbreak thing and put it again. After a bit, you will see the old Apple logo with the progress bar. Eventually, you will greet it with the iOS 6 setup screen. Do your thing and that's it! You now have a fully functional iOS 6 device with activation and everything, even a city app. So, I hope that you enjoyed your new install iOS 6 and thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.